ever wanted was to be somebody My reefer cloudy, lost to each assignment Making beats and rhyming, so proceed to find me My speech aligned with teacher, teacher Help me seek the knowledge, but the streets is evil We proceed to flee police assignments Alright, Nick over here is making me try 225 Let's go. for 5 on the 5th set so, my chest is already dead. We'll see how this one goes. Foul three below, six feet, my ego grow. Shorty grip it, both hands, letting off my ego low. Bust it back and forth, there's no remorse. I win, of course I'm in, you fraudulent. I'm selling drugs, where's the love? Hit my plug. This is for the 40 buses. Holding crutches, cause they know they hustlers. While the man is trying to cope with clutches. I drank a whole eight bottles, man, I won't this At least I got four, not three. Last time I got three. Gusters, cause even if it's champagne, better know your substance. Fancy niggas stuck on the brand name But any day it's so we over champagne I'm talking shit for my fans sake I give a fuck who can't relate I'm every landscape I paint the picture for peace Large wishes dismembered in several scenes I'm Kubrick with chemistry A degenerate generous lead Poor me, poor, poor me Got him hooked one time so I got an OD all I ever wanted, son, was a brick, a mask, and a hundred guns. Put a grip, better mash if you want it, son. For the chips, I be damn better run it, yo. Yeah. I'm painting portraits while it's off and spinning. I'm high as hell when indulging in these gorgeous women. Pave the future for boots as I'm contributing my two cents, so I'm a nuisance. Producing and I tighten the load like it's a nuisance. Who's this? Not for amusement, I'm never clueless. I do this, but never foolish. You doodle with nice with stoolers. My crew is cool as the fonts in your Ferris Bueller. No honor in my medulla, no time for your common coonery. Prognosis was doses of mean rot. Dreaming I'm be thugging like when a Feeney conceived pot. Papa told me fame would only flood my brain. So Alright boys, this was a very light workout today just because we have a lot to do. Black Friday is going to be insane this year. So like we need to get back to work and do as much work during the day as we can. So this was about a 35 minute workout. Literally did a lot of stuff though, if you can't tell. Four sets on about everything. But this is the post-workout pump. When you washed up is when you focus on these lanes. Money, murder, and music. My main objective is this. I'm pushing the envelope and I saw your death with a kiss. My soul and spirit. Conscious because I'm near it. The whisper is the mirror to all my merits. So fuck you if you ain't here it, nigga. All I ever wanted, son, was a brick, a mask, and a hundred guns. Put a grip, better mash if you want it, son. But hey, David. You moving to Texas? Of course. That's without a doubt. <laughs> Wait, how do I clean my lens with this? Uh, I cleaned it, but it's just like that. It blows the dust off. Yeah, it blows the dust off. Yeah. You used to blow one, aren't you? What's up? I know I suck at vlogging. I literally just got home. You got to give me a break. It's been a insane day at work. We're doing a ton of shit right now for Black Friday, but something just hit me. This is the last vlog that I have to make for the 30 day vlog challenge because I've already filmed another video. And I didn't think that this was going to be emotional. I didn't think honestly anything of it. I just woke up another day and just started vlogging. Like it was my routine. Over the past 30 days, I've put so much time and so much effort into these vlogs. <laughs> I told myself at the beginning of this challenge, if you can do this right here, if you can manage to put out 30 videos in 30 days, while working all the time, while making it way harder than it was last year. You can do, you can literally do anything. And I'm at, I'm at the finish line right now. At the beginning of this challenge, I was going through a really, really rough patch where I wasn't able to make the content or I didn't have any of the drive to make the content that I had been for a long time. And I didn't think my YouTube's going anywhere. I didn't think my TikTok's going anywhere. That really put a stress on my mental and I didn't think, I didn't think I was gonna be able to do this. I thought work was gonna get too much. I wasn't gonna have enough time. I was gonna fall behind and not be able to put out a video one day. Now that I'm looking back right now, this, is, this has been absolutely crazy. Because I know in the beginning of this challenge, I knew what I was up against. I knew that this was not going to be easy because last year when I did it, I did not have a job. I wasn't going to class a lot. 
I wasn't working at all and I decided to do this vlog challenge and it was hard then. Now this year, I have a full-time job I still go to class. I'm in a completely different city where I don't have all the time in the world to do this anymore. I heard something in the back of my head that Jake, you can't go another day without giving all of your effort to something. Jake, you if you want this content creation to work, if you want to be the hardest worker in every single room, you are slacking right now. I heard that voice in the back of my head. Now you might not think voices like that are real, but I know that's God talking to me. He's trying to give me that push to be a little bit better. He's trying to set me up for success and set me down the right path. I, I'm sitting right here in total disbelief and shock because it has absolutely flown by and I don't, I don't know how I did it. What I want you guys to take away from this, what I want you guys to see is that if you set your mind to it and say, there's no other option because I'm gonna die one day, there is no other option except for me to do this, then you can do it. That's the mentality that I had going into this challenge. Yes, I was scared. Yes, I didn't know if I was actually gonna work. Yes, I didn't know if I had all the time in the world. I told myself, that Jake, if you don't do this, you're never gonna get this opportunity back. So why would you not go give 100% effort in everything that you do? Who the fuck cares if you have to work eight hours a day? Who the fuck cares if you're at the office 10 hours a day? Who the fuck cares if the YouTube videos aren't there or are low? Just go fucking do it. Nobody cares. So why would you not work hard and chase those dreams? So with that being said, Let's get the final meal. Woo! Besides that first watch I had this morning, this has been the only other meal. So we got sriracha ranch, queso cheese, and chicken and rice. So it's just kind of a mashup right there. Well, boys, ending off this vlog challenge, I'm with my boy David right now. Hoffman, you ready to move to Texas? Of course. All right, so I have not done one of these reaction videos in probably like probably six months ever since I moved down to Texas. So I'm with David and we're gonna watch 57 workout fails that are going to be pretty bad. So, well, and you're gonna get like initial reaction to all of this. Here. First time watching it. Yeah, first time watching it. Here we go. I already see how it's this one. Oh! Look at those. Would you ever scream like that? Nah, he's just a no. pussy. Yeah. Oh, nah. Dude, he's doing this on purpose. Ain't no way. Ain't oh, no way. fuck your life. Look at the cheeks. I saw one where he. Oh, all right. Oh, I see this bullshit. That's his dickhead's fault. Look. Oh my god, bro. That wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. Bro. I've seen some worse. This gonna be you when you're older. He's saucy. <laughs> But he passes out. What do you think? It's yeah. Fall back. <laughs> hey, big trees fall hard. Crazy shit. Damn. That's heavy enough to hurt. Yeah. I'd be doing that one. I need to do that. My next fall. Yeah, plates fall. That's like my fucking biggest fear. It just like scares you. Yeah. <laughs> you got too much weight. Damn. How much was that? Like 30s? Yeah. Uh, yep, yeah, play small. Bro, that's a wimpy <laughs> ass squat rack, though. Ooh. Bro, I think he crushed his no boys tits. right there. Damn, that's a thick bar. Ain't no, ain't, ain't no spotter neither. It's a little scary, though. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, she, hey, she dismounted she on it. that. Uh, get that up. Ooh. Oh, that took her back with her. No, 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 no. I think no, it's just kind of. No, no. All right, good. I thought she had to fall on his neck. Bro, I've seen some of these where they do fall on their neck. That's the fucking worst. Or it like falls and it like crushes their chest. You know what really gets me? The fucking bone cracking one. It's like the dude squatting. Yeah. That's what happens when you don't put in all that effort. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's that kind of injury that just piss you off, yeah. bro. Stop working out type shit. 
This is just dumb. Like to be like, fair, that's just dumb. That's a lot of weight. That's not that bad. He definitely can't breathe. I love these home gym ones where they just like they're no spotters. Fucked up place. Ooh. Oh. I think he was about to pass out. Yeah, or that's what I was thinking too. Cause there's no way he just dropped it like that. Have some respectable weight on that bar if it's crushing you. What if it was just a bar? Oh, that'd be embarrassing. I oh. Damn, this form's kind of dookie sauce. Oh, that. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, it's I knew that, that was coming. It's a lot of this CrossFit, bro. Oh, shit. Oh, oh. damn. Just getting caught under that bar, man. What's the maneuver for that? Like, you just throw it at your dick and then just... Yeah, you, like, kind of sling it up. Yeah, like he's doing right there. But it hurts your thighs. I've been caught under one. Oh, no! Oh. That boy got a concussion after sure. that one. Have you ever done that where it's just yeah, embarrassing it's so embarrassing. as fuck? I felt, oh, yeah. There it goes again. That's what happened to Nick the other day. He was back at 315, yeah, and it slid off, slid off on one. Drop it, my boy. Oh, man, you fuck that shit up. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Come on, get it up, my boy. Get it up, don't drop it. Fuck. Oh, it's, see, like, if you the get worst it too part far. Is... Bro, that's on his face, man. Oh. Okay, that's all his strength. Ah, <laughs> that was a little jump scare right shot. there. Let's get a face full of fish. Oh! Wow! So, wow! <laughs> we should actually try that tomorrow. Two hand, two feet, not one. Yeah, he's fucking. Oh. He's fucking. He's you, de you deserve that yeah, for doing fucking that fucking dumb fucking shit. Fucking. Oh, that form, bro. Is he cleaning that? No more ACL. Oh, I think I've seen this one before. Bro, his ankles are stuck under there. Oh, he's gonna break his back. He was at a curve. What is this old man doing? Hey, that's some Arkansas right there. <laughs> my uncle. <laughs> oh, this oh, latest he's motherfucker. Doing. He's like, back in my day. I used to. Oh! <laughs> It'd be the old head. <laughs> he yeah, thought he, he had still got it. Yeah. Oh, man. Damn. There were two bad of ones in there, honestly. Thank yeah, God, though. Works. I've seen some bad ones. I like I, the, the, the bone smash and shit. Like, when they break their bones and you, shit. You want to watch them bone smash it? I'm fucking down. <laughs> All right, bet. Hey, boys, well, I am back in the office signing off this vlog. Y'all absolutely killed this last to knock a drop. Thank you so much. Fry Supplements, the new Godzilla pre-workout will be dropping Thursday. Code Jake will save you 30%, making that Godzilla pre-workout only $40. So make sure to go pick that up. I will see you guys later. Thank you again for all the support on this challenge. And remember, dreams aren't going to work unless you do. So go after it.